Welcome to Epic Deals. After numerous hours of researching and analyzing, we are going to break down this top list to make sure that you are getting the epic deal. Honestly saying, our team reads a lot of user-based reviews, analyze pro cons and make a smart selection so that you can make better buying decisions. Just make sure to check the product links in the description. Let's get started. Here are the 5 best value graphics card. So, let's get started. Number 1, most popular, Essus ROG Strix GE Force RTX. If money is no object to you and you have to have the absolute best performance possible, then an RTX 3090 is what you're looking for. Be forewarned, though, with a price tag of over $3,000, an RTX 3090 costs more right now than what it would have cost to build a complete high-end system just a couple of years ago. That's the effect of the global chip shortage and massive inflation. If you've got the money for it, though, the RTX 3090 is a monster of a graphics card and it will deliver extreme performance. And, of the RTX 3090s out there, we like the SS ROG Strix OC Edition for its advanced cooling configuration and its extreme factory overclock. All in all, the elevated price tag of the RTX 3090 won't be for everyone. But, if your budget allows for it, you won't be disappointed. Number 2. MSI Gaming Radeon RX 6900 XT. If you're an AMD fanboy through and through and you want the best graphics card they have to offer, then an RX 6900 XT is what you're looking for. Of the RX 6900 XTs out there, the MSI Gaming Z Trio strikes a nice balance between how much it costs and the features it comes with. The Gaming Z Trio comes with a boost clock of 2425 MHz, 16GB of VRAM, and a triple fan cooling array. It also features RGB lighting and measures in at 325mm long. The RX 6900 XT is an excellent option for gamers who have an extreme budget and who are looking to hop into 4K gaming, or who want to run a 1440p 240Hz monitor with good results. Number 3. Zotac Gaming GE Force RTX Trademark Symbol 3060. The RTX 3060 T is an excellent graphics card for people who have a moderate budget and who want to be able to max out games on a 1080p monitor. This card is more moderately priced when compared to the extreme options listed above and it can also serve well for anyone looking to jump up to 1440p gaming. It does only feature a dual fan cooling array but that shouldn't impact its performance too much in the grand scheme of things. In the end, if you're looking for a graphics card that will easily allow you to max out games at 1080p and also offer the ability to handle games at 1440p and 4K for non-demanding titles, then this RTX 3060T is not a bad option. Number 4. Zotac Gaming GE Force RTX 3050. While no graphics cards are affordable right now, ZOTAC's Twin Edge lineup is consistently among the lowest cost options in their given GPU category. The same is true for their RTX 3060T as with their RTX 3050. The RTX 3050 is currently selling for over $500 and will deliver solid 1080p performance. The Zotac Twin Edge comes with an 1807 MHz boost clock, 8GB of GDDR6 VRAM, and a dual fan cooling array. With its smaller cooling array, the card only comes in at 224mm long, making it an excellent option to use in smaller cases. Overall, if you're looking for a more affordable new graphics card option ZOTAC's Twin Edge RTX 3050 is worth considering. Number 5. Gigabyte GVN 1030OC2GI NVIDIA. The Gigabyte GT1030 competes with the RX 550 in that both are super-budget friendly graphics cards that will work well if you are building a bare-bones entry-level system, or if you have an older system that needs to be upgraded in order to keep up with some of today's newer games. Typically, this card would come in at well under $100, but with inflation, it currently costs nearly $200 to land. Ultimately, this card isn't a long-term solution, but it will serve well as a last resort option if you have a super low budget. For more details click the link in the description. Thanks for stopping by. Please like this video if you enjoyed and subscribe to our channel for the new videos. Pitch any opinion, question or advice in the comment box.